What's going on guys? I'm Andrew with Camper Kingdom in Meridian, Mississippi. And if you're in the market for an RV that's all centered around the kitchen in your living area, once you do come inside at the end of the night, then you're not gonna wanna miss this new 2022 and a half Coachman Brookstone model number 374RK. If you're new here, we welcome you to the channel. Continue to show your support by leaving your feedback in the comment section down below. And let's get started. Coming at you 42 feet, two inches of total length with a dry weight of 12,960 pounds. Gross vehicle weight rating though, 15,500. And talking about being an overachiever, the Brookstone model is 101 inches wide. Wide body construction. This camper is gonna be level from a six point electric leveling system. You've got a hitch weight on this coach of 2,212 pounds. I love the different accent lights. You got the blue on the front. You got kind of a gold on the top, but underneath some of the slides, you'll have accent lights as well. I'll show them to you once we get over there. Let's go ahead and show you where all the controls to raise and lower your coach are at. They're gonna be found inside of the basement area here. Magus doors on the Brookstone right at about an inch and a half thick. But just by simply pressing the one button, the coach will fight level itself. There's your battery disconnect switch and look at this the bench is over here right at four feet across by three and a half feet, feet tall and the way the brooks don't achieve all of this is by riding on a drop frame construction so that's gonna be the 12 inch i-beam construction that it's mainly riding on and then they give you this 10 inch drop frame construction there's one of your sewer 10 gallon gas real electric hot water heater that's the furnace there's your power hook up camper's also going to be heated with a 40,000 BTU furnace that's the exhaust but you also have this is a true four season camper so you do have 12 volt tank heaters found on all of the holding tanks on the Brookstone oh yeah the lights that's really cool makes it easier finding your camper in the campground later in the evening the Brookstone model also gives you two different awnings. This one's 18, that one's 11. Outdoor speakers, frameless windows found throughout. And look at these baggage doors. Really thick, double slam latches. Another shot of your pass-through compartment with this rubber type material, oil resistant. You do have television connections over here as well. I love the magnetic latches to hold these doors up. Lipper component steps, these do flip up and inside the door, your entryway is right at six foot two. There's your awning LED lights. Asdale found on board, true four season camper, model number 374 RK. So what is Asdale? Asdale is the material found behind the fiberglass. It is a non-wood material, so if it ever makes contact with water, your coach will not delaminate swell calls mold outdoor refrigerator and again i like to point out the big thick baggage doors found all the way around the coach coming around to the back of the coach you actually have a bumper a lot of models like look over here next to the alpine with no bumper brookstone does provide you with that four x four tube of the bumper also a great place to store all of your sewer lines it is prepped for a blindside camera Rear mounted ladder, 250 pound low capacity for your rear mounted ladder as well. And this is what I'm talking about. Store all your sewer lines in here when you're finished camping. Keep them organized. Two inch receiver found on the back of the coach also. This is for like a bike rack or luggage rack, not for pulling an additional trailer. Your slide mechanisms, rack and pinion slides found on these two, this one and that one up there. Take a look at more accent lights found all the way throughout the Brookstone. We do go inside, but talking about a really, really nice rear kitchen, open concept style floor plan that Coachman has come up with. Absolutely beautiful. There's a couple of minor things that I changed here and there, but I think they nailed it. Solid surface countertops found all the way throughout your kitchen. You even have the 12 volt refrigerator and pay no attention to the lights. They're gonna start to flicker as we go around. That's truly my fault. I left the battery disconnect switch on yesterday. So I had to come out with my vehicle just to provide us with a little bit of power. So it's trying to charge 
with me also keeping all the lights on inside. Love the cabinetry though. Coachman gives you the accent lights behind the cabinetry with the smoke tent. You do have an electric fireplace, but again, you'll notice the heating vents throughout the floor coming from the 40,000 BTU furnace will be most of the heat though. Sitting for six in your living room, but this one here is gonna be the trifold sleeper sofa that opens up in three. Both sets of the recliners will have the heat and the massage option. And that's really nice to know you've got two sets of recliners instead of just two sleeper sofas. Freestanding table with four chairs. And you do have the added leaf for additional elbow room. All the windows inside the Brookstone will be trimmed out with these white roller shades. It would have been nice to maybe have a balance to continue all the way down. But still, they do a really great job with the windows already being pre-tinted from the factory. But coming back to the kitchen area, check this out. So outside, that was the outdoor kitchen. I would have liked to have maybe seen more cabinetry and done away with just the refrigerator on the outside. I'm interested to know your feedback. Tell me down in the comments, what do you think about that? High point microwave. That's not a convection. And that's still, again, I love the smoke accent, cabinetry. Lots of sunlight coming from this really big window. You do have this really high up there, white roller shade though to block out some of that sunlight if you don't want it. Stainless steel single basin sink, high rise faucet. Look at your oven hood vent. Love the carpentry work here. You do have those accent lights found in the, some of the cabinets also. I would have also liked to have seen the bigger oven that Forest River puts in some of their floor plans. I do believe they came out with a prototype putting the larger oven in the Brookstone model, but they didn't get the feedback they were expecting, so they didn't go with it. Larger pantry, smoke accent, there is there is a light up there so your slide all the slides in the brookstone in your living area you're right at six foot ten ever chill refrigerator three different sections freezer on the bottom fridge on the top and these cords are what you're going to use to strap around the fridge whenever you're in transit you do have this really cool little island with some bar stools giving you a little bit more eating range all with that fireplace again there is your sound bar I want to give you a quick walk over this before we head upstairs all your controls gonna be located here in the hallway that's the tank heaters I was talking about making it a true four season camper all of your slide switches your tank monitoring station hot water heater selector switch between gas or electric and this is gonna be the single thermostat to control both, let me turn around, of your air conditioners. The Coachman Brookstone is gonna be outfitted with two Coleman Mach air conditioners. One of them is gonna be a 15K, the other is a 13.5. They are both racetrack together. Notice the lights flickering, by the way. Ceiling fan. So that was one of the other things they did on the prototype, is they installed three air conditioners, but their feedback didn't give them what they were expecting but it used to be mounted there, but now you're only gonna get two. I do believe from my experience here in Mississippi though, two air conditioners would definitely keep this coach plenty cool. But wow, look at this. Really, really big bathroom. Kind of gives you that residential feel. His and her sinks, porcelain sinks. That's one thing I also like about the Brookstone. I also love the fact that it's got the Asda. Asda is a good thing for campers. More manufacturers should go into that. Porcelain foot flush toilet, really, really big shower. I do believe you're looking at dimensions of 30 by 50, lots of headroom. This is your linen closet, but golly, the headroom inside the brooks. Let's take a look at your bedroom area. Your bedroom door has that smoke tent again. King size bed with the east to west bed, dimensions of 70 by 80. Really nice. I love the cup holder. Yay. Brookstone, you get a thumbs up for that one. Breeze windows on both sides, and notice where you have the shelf also. So you could possibly have two different shelves. Good place maybe for a cell phone, plus the 110 outlet up there. And this is just gonna be for additional light. But I really like the, the cup holder inside of the 
the little shelf there at the at the armrest of the bed everybody knows you're gonna have a drink next to the bed and that's just a big plus to have that you could add a stackable washer and dryer in the front closet and they've also trimmed out this one over here with a mirror plenty of room though to move around up in the bedroom area and that's gonna be that second Coleman mock air conditioner let's take a look at the price so our sales price of ninety thousand nine nine five. you can also view more pictures over at our website at camperkingdom.com MSRP on this coach of $113,793. Once again, guys, I greatly do appreciate you sticking around this long in the video. Continue to show your support by leaving a thumbs up down below. Continue to like and subscribe. Come see us.